YouTube, Try Stars. I mean, good afternoon, good good day. It's a wonderful evening. Actually, I'm at the company here in um, Ontario, and I decide to, you know, polish my headlights or clean my headlights. You know what I mean? On my Volvo truck, because I see where it's it's have some white, foggy look. You know what I mean? I tried cleaning them before, but now I'm gonna take it. I'm gonna do it a different. You know, different step. You know what I mean? So I'm just gonna get into it and let you guys know what I'm what I'm gonna do. You know what I mean? I'm what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna wet wet sand. I'm gonna wet sand the headlights. That that's that's the first thing. So I have my sandpapers and I have so okay. So I'm gonna use tapes. I'm gonna use tape to border the the so that the polish that I'm gonna use is not gonna go on the the rubber at the side of the the, the, the the light so I'm gonna tape tape around the lights and then I'm gonna uh, wet sand I'm gonna wet sand I'm gonna use I'm gonna use all depends on, on how bad it is it's not that bad I'm gonna show you in a bit but I'm gonna use wet sand I'm gonna use the 3000 grit with the wet sandpaper and this is which one is this this is no that this, this one is too high I was looking at 600 just now okay uh, this one is 1000 okay so I'd rather use the 1000 so I, I look at the back and it, it I don't know if you get okay you can see the 1000 yeah so it's the 1000 grit with wet sand I'm gonna use water and you know wash it rub it down wash it down and then my final touch I'm gonna use the 3000 grit and then after I finish using all those sandpaper on it you know I dry or I wipe it off and then I will polish. I'm gonna use the mother's. You guys can see. It's the mother power plastic for lights. And it's it says uh headlight lens restored. Look, uh, if you guys can actually see without that glory, you know what I mean? So this is it, and this is what I'm gonna use on my headlights. And hopefully, what, what I'm looking for is complete. So, yes, peeps, try stars. We're gonna do the headlight on the Volvo truck now. We're gonna make it, you know, my having my, my LED light already, right? So, we need the light to look shiny and looking good, looking great for the road. So, we're going out there and we're gonna get this done. We're gonna get this over with. So, try stars, thanks for tuning in. Oh, oh, before I go, I didn't let you guys know I actually have my power tool this is called like a buffer this is what I'm gonna use to buff my light after after I put the polish on it I'm gonna plug it in I'm gonna squeeze and you know what I mean we're gonna get to work we're gonna make sure um, the light look the way how it should look so this is it like I said this is a power tool um, I got it on sale from the Canadian Tire um, that don't remember how much I paid for it. I think it was maybe fifty dollars or something. Yeah. So, so that's it. So we're going outside now. We're gonna get a pan with some water. After we get the water, then we um, we start our journey. And thanks again, Try Stars. For more videos like this, please subscribe. Okay, YouTube. This is it. This is what I'm talking about. As you can see, there's some fog looking. It's not clear, you know. Um, it's 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 not like I said. It's it's foggy. It's dirty, really. We need to get these these stuff out. So I'm gonna, like I said, I'm gonna wet sand all around. You know what I mean? And then I'm gonna polish after. So this is this is what I'm about to do. I mean, this side is not that bad, but you can still see where you got this fog, um, blurry looking, you know what I mean? Up up and about, you know, if you look closely, you can see what I'm talking about. So I think we need, we need to get this stuff out. So that is my aim, to get my light looking shiny and looking good. So this is our journey, and we're going to start. Thanks for tuning. Try start. Yes, YouTube. Let's start. I'm just gonna start tape, um, taping the edges where the rubber um, is. 
because I mean I don't want to get the, the polish onto the rubber because you know when when it's dry it's hard or difficult to get off right so I'm gonna go ahead and just tape the rubbers and you know on both sides to get on our journey now right here now I'm looking for the thousand grit like I said before you can you can go ahead and start with six hundred grit that um, the lower the number the, the, the rougher it is so the higher the number the thinner the, the sandpaper that is now I'm using the, the 1000 which is a bit fine I'm using it to get out all those um, white foggy look well it, it, it will be it will be it will be the residue of the the substance that is that was on the light before like used to, to polish the light from the, the dealer or from the manufacturer you know what I mean so what I'm doing right now I'm rubbing I'm getting off that old steel um, protection um, UV thing that was on the light before you know that, that, that is the reason for it to change color in the first place so I'm using the sandpaper to rub that substance off you know what I mean so all depends on how bad it look um, determine the type of sandpaper you want to start with you know I could go ahead and start with 600 but it wasn't that um, like deep yellow and really really like some some that I'm seeing out there right now that would need like 600 grit you know just to get off just to get it back down to the, the that's the plastic you know what I mean it's gonna be a, it's gonna look a bit dull you know what I mean when I'm finished as if you if you look closely on the, the screen here you can see where it's getting white you know what I mean like you can see the white um, substance thing getting off the, 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 the plastic that's what the, the sandpaper is doing right now. So it's a wet sand, you use water and you just rub. You know what I mean? And you gotta spend some time on it if you want it to, if you want the result to, to look pleasing. You can't rush it, you just take your time, you know, um, do it on a day when you're when you're like, you know, sitting down, maybe you don't have anything doing, just have all the materials. I'm gonna leave a link in the description of everything that I used on this light today so you guys can look at it check it out and you know you can order from the link or you can go ahead and just get it where else just to you know have your your light look, looking 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 good because to be honest when you got a cleaner light the truck look more pleasing to you well more it look it look good you know what i mean like when the dollar the light the truck look older to be honest that's the that's a small cleaning of the headlight and it bring out a really good look it, back in the truck you know what i mean the 600 i'm gonna change sandpapers i'm gonna use the the 3000 this is the final rub this is a final fine this is a finer gra grade of sandpaper if the 1000 leave any scrapes or any scratches on the the, the plastic this thousand grit will get it out you know what i mean put it back smooth like before you know what i mean before we start polishing so that's the purpose of using the two um sandpaper which i said you can go three just in case of the oh oh how bad the light look you know what i mean you would need like a, a, a rougher sandpaper but the, the thousand and the three thousand will work fine you, you got 1500 also you know what i mean you can take a lot of time if you need but um, like I said here, I just needed 1,000 just to start, just to get off that um, polish or whatever they put on it before. And then I'm using the 3,000 to smooth down that light, get it back right down to when, when I look at it, it is so smooth. You know what I mean? All I need to do next was just to put on the polish. So that being said, I'm doing the two lights at once, which I should just maybe just do one just to show you guys but it's for the video I'm just showing you that um, you know I tape both sides and I'm rubbing to perfection Now 
this is it youtube um look at it it's looking like brand new right because you know when, when it's wet it always give you that look but now that you can look at it there's you can see there's a lot of work just by rubbing the light with that wet sand can you can see where where, where we're heading you know what i mean you just need the right polish now if you can look at the background beyond the polish you can see the headlights looking dull right because that's when it dry it's gonna look dull because there's nothing on it right now to protect it protect it or anything so that's what we're doing right now we're putting on this polish to give it bring out back that shine and that glassy look like it like it was when it when it was purchased brand new so this is what we're doing we put in some of the the liquid on the rag and then we're um, rubbing in the polish and we're gonna let it sit for like you know five minutes or so you know just to get it soaking in the, in, in the glass and everything and um, based on how it look when we are done we're gonna give it a second coat if we need it to and um, yeah so basically that's it so just sit back you know you, you already know the procedure so that's this is what we are doing right now the polishing we're rubbing in the, 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 the polish onto the plastic and let it soak in before we turn that a buffer on to see the result This is it now YouTube. This is the moment of truth. As you can see the you can see the difference already. Where you can see the, oh man. Look what's going on YouTube. This is it, this is it, this is it. This is the moment of truth. We, we haven't anywhere yet and look at it. Now, for all those Volvo lights that I'm seeing out there, I have no reason to be dull. I have no reason not to not to clean your Volvo lights now. Look how easy it is. No hassle. Just a five minute. You know, it, it take like 20 minutes out of your day just to do this and you're good. So you have no reason for those ugly headlights anymore. It, not only Volvo trucks, any trucks rather um cars or trucks you know this does work but um with the volvo i see more volvo trucks with the 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 the, the glass really you know look look looking um dirty yellow or or unpleasing to the eyes you know but more more like because the glass is more facing the sun i, I would think you know what I mean? They got more glass, more uh, headlight exposing in the hair and the sun and, you know what I mean? Yes, YouTube. So this is the journey. This is it. Tell me what you guys think. Tell me if it if it worked. Tell me if 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 I did a good job. Tell me if um it makes sense doing it. You know what I mean. Um, this is the journey. You too, try stars. As I mean, I said, this is uh, a second coating on the light. You know what I mean? Um, I just want to tell you guys that I mean the, the, the light is pretty much it was terrible. You know what I mean? Horrible. You know what I mean? Use a word. It was rough. It was it wasn't looking great. You know what I mean? And um, like I said, this thing we really really does work. Yes, as I mean, I said, this this thing does does work. Is the mother's. Uh, power plastic 
for lights, like I said, it really, really does work. You know what I mean? Um, this is like a second coating on the glass, which you guys already see that I already uh, do a lot already. Um, so this is just a second coating, like I said before. Um, it, it really, really look great already. I didn't even have to do a second coating, but I'm just doing it just for the video. You know what I mean? So, like I said, I, I'm using this power tool, this buffer tool really, with this um, stock thing on it. And um, yeah, so far, so good. You know what I mean? So, try stars. Thanks for tuning in. And, you know what I mean? I'm giving all these tips for you guys to fix up those um, Volvo headlights that I'm seeing out there. You know what I mean? There's a lot of breeze blowing in the background, but I'm gonna um, do what I'm doing and hurry up. Thanks for tuning in. Try stars trucking. Peace. Whoa, whoa, YouTube. Tell me what you think. Tell me what you think. Leave me a comment. Leave me a comment. Talk to me. Talk to me in the description, peeps. Thanks for tuning in. Try stars. For more videos like this, please subscribe.